Hey everybody, this is Crazy with Crazy Gaming. We're back for another episode of The Planet Crafter 1.0. This is a full release of the game. And we did our beginning episode yesterday. And today we're on episode 2. And we are going to pick up right where we left off. And what we're trying to do is raise these numbers so that we can unlock more things. But today we're going to focus on getting back over to our uh, to the crash. So I'm going to build another chest. Do we have any iron in here? No, we don't. We need to get an iron. We need to build another chest. Give me an iron. My kingdom for a piece of iron. Come on. So like I was saying yesterday, I started playing this game during the beta. And then I played the prologue for a long time. I have a long series on it. But I'm curious as the, the changes as we go on, we're going to find out more about the changes that have happened in this release. Not real sure exactly what all those things are. I have not been following the game for quite some time. A lot of times developers take quite a while to do their patches, but they did quite a few in a real short amount of time in the last few months between the end of last year and this year. And so they've really been busy on it and uh, uh, Hopefully they'll garner a lot of success from that. I hope They're, these guys have been fairly diligent. Come on, I can't believe I can't find any iron. That's silicone. And this happens. You know, there's, it's weird, this game, you know, there'll be times when you can't find any titanium to save your life or silicone. And you can just find, and laying around all over the place, there's tons of iron and what call it. So this thing's empty, we can deconstruct it, so we don't come back to it anymore. It's been time looking, running to it to open it or whatever. Pretty sure there's another chest out here, down here somewhere. I can't remember where exactly. It might be up this way more. There it is. We've got some iron now. Let's go see what's in this box. There's two more foods. That's great. We need the food. I'm going to take the iron because that's what I'm hunting at this point. Yeah, I guess we'll grab these silicones last. The other items seem to be fairly easy to find. A lot of iron over here along that hill, so we'll be going along that cliff face to go up to the other wreck here soon. But for now, I want to finish what we're doing over here. Our KTI is up to 10, so we're doing really well that way. Hopefully we can make it back inside before we die. And then we made it. Let's have us a water. I'm going to have to make some more of that. Beacon is unlocked. Don't care about the beacon at this point right now anyway. Care about making water. Alright, let's stow some of this stuff. We can't. Oh, that's what we were doing. We were going so we could get another chest. Let's make our next chest. See, it doesn't let you stack them. I wish it did. 
the mouth just unlocked. So let's put these in there. I'm going to only bring one with us. Oh, I ate it? Are you kidding me? That's not what I wanted to do. There we go. And then we don't need this. 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 Put those in there and let's put those in there. We'll bring a couple irons along with us. One silicone. And one magnesium. We will grab... Okay, so I gotta take a quick break, go cut my wife's hair, I'll be right back. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we're back, sorry about that. Let's run out and cut my wife's hair real quick. She wanted a, a number two on her head for the summer and so I took her up and hooked her up. Anyway, that being said, um, where were we? Okay, so let's see what we've unlocked now. What we've got unlocked. Okay, we've got the beacon, T3 oxygen tanks. Now, I don't know if we did those yet. Let's look and see. Nope, we're in the T2. So let's do the T3 oxygen tanks. See what we need for that. We're going to need some titanium and some aluminum. I think we've got some of that somewhere. There's some aluminum. There's some titanium. Let's do this thing. Okay, so we can last longer. We'll be able to last longer in the... Uh, ooh, the T2 agility boots on off too. Oh, we can't do anything with those yet. Maybe we should make a trip out there and try and grab... Let's try and grab the... Uh, the that ore that we need. So we got water, we got food. How many oxygen tanks do we have with us? We have two oxygen tanks, we got water, we got food. We should probably make some more water. Yeah, let's get some ice and do some more water real quick. So it's a little hinky on that, I noticed. We'll make another oxygen bottle. Yeah, this thing's getting... I'm going to grab a titanium. We'll grab another iron. Maybe another iron. And we're going to need, I think... And titanium, and we're going to need a silicon. Okay. Do a silicone in here. Yes. Let's bring another food. And just make some water real quick. All right, so we got water, we got food. Let's drink the water, fill up. Let's eat the food, fill up. Let's head out. Wait, how are we doing on oxygen bottles? We got two. We should be all right. I hope. It's a long trip over there, so. But one of the great things about this game is you can build something and then deconstruct it you get all of you 100 of the materials back so you can build again we can travel over here and when our oxygen starts getting low we can build this room run inside regenerate our oxygen come outside pick it back up and move along with it there is another wreck up out that way if i turn my head you should be able to see it on the right side of the screen over there it's in that you can't really see it yet but it's just um beyond that black mound over there i think you'll be able to see it over here right there it is 
It's another wreck. So we're almost halfway through our oxygen now. And I believe this cave is right along here. Just past the gap. It's just beyond this gap right here. I think it's just up here ahead. He's pulling water. Yep, that's it. Let's put it. Let's put in. I think that's a place to do our oxygen and stuff real quick. Oh, all right, there we go. Let's fill the door. Oh, we're missing the. That's not good. We're missing this. That was close. All right, we'll leave that like that for now. Let's run into the cave. Oops. Where are we at? The entrance should be right here. There it is. Okay. So now we should be able to find, and there you go. Super alloy. This cave is full of it. I'm pretty sure there's a chest. We should find some more in here, I think. Nope, but we found another one of those. We found another water. And we'll leave the rest of that here for now. There's another one there. And then, what's our inventory looking like? Yeah, we want to get a bunch of these. Now, in the prologue game, or the pre-release game, these things won't respawn when you grab them, but you can drill for them in here when we get the ore drillers. So we're going to want to try to do this quickly and get back out because we're not going to be coming back over here for a while. Here's another chest. Ah, there's a new seed. There's a new seed. There's another water. And we can't take anything else but full, so we might as well head back. And you can get lost in these caves really easy, too, so be mindful of that. Oh, this is the wrong way. See, that's what I'm talking about. The entrance is back over this way. Oh, there's another one. We can't get it there. These are in the toys full. But that's the exit right there. And there's another one there that we must have missed when we came in. Let's go get our oxygen replenished. And we'll have this room here so we know that we can run right here and we have enough oxygen on us now. And we could make that trip fairly simple. Let's get it. We're going to go ahead and drink the water. And let's head back to the base. And so, for this, this video is mostly for the people that have never played the game before or are interested in the game. Maybe watch some videos on it that haven't really tried it for themselves yet. The game is a lot of fun. It, it, it's 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 a little you know it's, the challenge on a scale of one to ten challenge wise it's probably around maybe a seven. So it's not so challenging. It's so difficult that you can't you know uh, press through in the game. 
it can be grindy at times, but not too, too terrible. Uh, I've played a lot of games, and you know, some games can be so grindy, you just, after a while, you just kind of give up on them. You don't want to play it anymore because it plays more like work than fun. You could build to your heart's content in this game and design and build it anywhere you want. It's just nice. That sandbox feeling. Um, there's a lot of cool secret kind of deals here. You know, secret underground stuff and secret uh, apartments and what whatnot that you'll come across in this game. So we ran from there to here, and we are at 280. So we have plenty of time to make a run between here and that super alloy that we just collected. And then we'll allow us to make those legs now. So what else do we need? Oh, we need the, the cloth. Now the fabric we can't make. I mean, we can't make the fabric for a while yet. So let's see what we can stow. Let's stow as much of that as we can. We're going to grab a couple of more irons. Maybe I'm not going to carry those around with us. Let's see if we can unlock a new recipe or something cool. T2 mining speed, so we can now upgrade our mining speed from T1 to T2. We need a silicon and a super alloy. So grabbing all that super alloy is actually smart. Let's get us a silicon. I don't know if we have any. It doesn't look like we do. Let's go get some, grab one from somewhere around here. I think there's some back this way. All right, okay, there's one. Sometimes it's really hard to find stuff. All right. But yeah, we'll go ahead and we'll get the, the T2. T2 drill now. That'll really crack. we got to start building that one. There's the new solar panels. So what was the new thing that we unlocked? Oh, the drilling speed. Okay, so let's make that. Let's check our inventory. Now we're doing T2 mining, which means we can mine this a little faster, which goes pretty fast as it is, so I'm not really too concerned about it. There's the eggplant seeds. Shang Nana is 150. So let's see what we got planted over here. And there's this one does 200 percent This one does hardly nothing. So we'll be taking that out and we will replace it like that. Which means now we're doing 150%. So we need to start building more of those. So we have, we need an ice, a silicone, and a magnesium. So let's go grab those things. Ice, a silicone, and a magnesium. Now out in this direction that we're heading right now is aluminum. There's a big aluminum ore. Dealy walk back out this way. There's also another gold chest over here. I'll be going after that after a while. I don't really, I'm not really chasing down the, the gold chests at the moment because they're not really that important to us at this phase of the game. And then actually, most of that stuff we can't really use. So we end up, uh, we end up sitting uh, holding it in inventory, you know. So what's the point of that? Okay, so let's take this stuff back and see if we can't go ahead and make that. We're also going to want to build a T3 drill. Let's see, where are we at? Ah, there we go. There's our exoskeleton, too. All right. What do we got here?
ET solar panels. I was looking for the, oh, this, the veggie tube. So we should be able to clap that now. What is this? Veggie tube one, veggie tube two. This is new. Oh, we need a, uh, we have some of those. We need a magnesium. Let's get two of them. So we can maybe build more than one of these things. Yeah, so this is the new veggie tube. Which looks exactly the same as that one. No, it doesn't. I mean, it's different. All right, so let's put this one down. And so let's take this out of here. Let's put it in here. Let's see if we can build another one of those. Up, we need some ice. Let's go grab some ice real quick. That's everywhere, so it's easy to find. All this stuff is going to be melting here soon, too, by the way. So ice will melt, begin melting when the temperature gets real in it. So if you're going to play the game, keep that in mind. So it might be wise to grab a bunch of, take some time and grab a bunch of ice and make a bunch of water bottles and store them once you get the bigger storage locker. And just fill it up with bottles of water when you have them. All right, let's sit down this next one. I actually put that there. I'm going to grab this out of here. I'm going to open this up. And I'm going to put that in there. I am going to deconstruct this one. Construct it back. And I'm going to put it right next to this one. And then I want to connect, construct one more. And now we have all the stuff to make the next one. Let's get that as close as we can. All right. Let's put the next one back in here. That's 200%. All right, that's rolling. What is this one doing? This one is doing 200% as well. Let's grab that. And let's put it in here. There we go. Let's go ahead and deconstruct these things that we're not going to need them anymore. And let's see if we can't make that T2 up to So we need an aluminum and a titanium. There is an aluminum here. And we need a titanium. We don't have any. So we'll have to run outside and grab one. But the titanium seemed pretty common many of the year. Now that we need one, we probably have a hard time finding them. There's one right there, I think. And in fact, let's grab a second. Let's grab this silicon before we forget that it's here. Okay. Now we'll get that new exoskeleton. Okay, so let's unlock these other things so that we can put more stuff in them as it unlocks. What do we have coming up? A T3 drill. The food grower is next. All right, so we got 12. We're going to need to get that up to 12, and that's the oxygen. Now that we have those bigger veggie tubes rolling, maybe it will want to cook up the three T3 veggie tube. It's a food grower, the T3 veggie tube, grass spreader, T3 heater. Transmission screens, communication antenna, living compartment, glass, glass floor and ceiling for living compartments. Nuclear reactor, 
there are ways to get to that advanced craft station. We're going to really need that. The double bed we don't care about. There's the storage locker. We want that. That thing's really nice. Well, out there. We'll be able to store a lot of stuff in it. We can start storing oil and all kinds of things. All right, so things seem to be moving along nicely. We're at 12.7%. 22.29 TK on KTI, which means we've got a long ways to go before we get there. Here comes a storm, meteor shower, I think. Nope. Just a solar storm, I guess. And that's new, too. I don't remember us having solar storms. Every time we had a storm, it was all about uh, meteors. But I don't know. It's been a while, like I said. Anyhow, so, I think our next order of business is to go and try and clear out that wreck. How much food do we have in our inventory? We only have one. Let's get rid of the ore and stuff. We don't need that stuff to go with us. So, let's put titanium in that. And those. Let's make some water. Oh, we don't need to carry this around. Let's take the titanium back and let's get rid of the seed. We don't need to carry that around with us. Alright, let's make some water. How much ice do we have left? Okay, so that took care of that. So we got plenty of water. Let's drink. And then we don't have any room for it in there, do we? Nope. But we do have a food in there we can bring. Which opens up the spots. Put a water in there. Alright. Let's head over. Now there is a cleft over here. Like a little canyon kind of ravine thing. It's right off that big... This big knob of a stone rock here. And down the bottom should be another chest. Yep, there it is. Let's see if there's anything in here we need. We could use the food. And I think we'll leave the rest of this stuff for another time when we need it. We got plenty of water. You can also find super alloy in these caves up on the upper decks. And there is another crash, spacecraft crash in there. Let's get some oxygen all the way up. Let's go ahead and eat a food. And we'll eat a second one because I'm sure we're going to find some in here. And let's run inside and see what we can come up with. Push F. And it's been a while since I've been through here, so... Who are we leaving here? Yeah, we can leave that stuff. We don't need it right now. We did this chest, I think, already. But we left one of the foods. We want that. This is another 200 pedestra. That's 150. That's 150. We'll leave the Lerma Seed. Lerma Seed's going to be handy, and we're going to need it. Oh, there's. this should have a blueprint in it. You'll see these little ones that have the blueprints. You want to definitely grab those. All right. Also check the lockers. Is there seed packs in the lockers sometimes? Check both sides. And with this, this is why this to ex to get to the next level on the the light thing is great because this thing is just really weak. It's like looking through a telescope with a tiny thing. All right. There's the double bed unlocked. There's another food. Let's grab that. We we'll need the ore for now. Let's go through here. I'm going to need to deconstruct that. Don't forget to look on the sides. Make sure there's nothing laying down. Let's deconstruct that. And there we have a heater. I'm going to deconstruct the heater and we're full so we can't pick up all the materials for that heater so what we're going to do is head out
And I'm going to run back in here. And now we are going to actually construct a storage unit so that we can stow stuff from here. I'm going to hit F to open it up. And let's stow all this stuff that we just picked up. And we'll only keep the stuff that's necessary in our bag. So there's the stones and stuff that we couldn't pick up. So let's pick that stuff up now. Now we have the ability to build another one. Oh, look, there's another blueprint. We'll take that. Open up this chest. We got new seeds. There's some block. We need one more of those, and I'd be able to build that next feet. There's a super alloy. There's another 200 to best for seed. There's another seed back. I'm going to leave the rest of this. Now, this is showing a drill. Now, that's a tool we don't have yet. And in the game that I was playing before, we got an ability, I think, late in later game to be able to build the drill. And we can't build it yet. So, these probably both have that signal. Yep. And so until we can get the drill built, which is going to be later game, then we can't really do much with that. All right, so we got this stuff. Let's get rid of this. Now we don't think it's something in there. And I know there's a way to get... There's a second floor in this machine, in this phone. I can't remember which way to go to get there. I, I thought it was right here. And this is not it? Nope. It's not. We've been down here already. So they may have changed it. There was a second room that you went that went off from the main room that you could go inside of, and I thought it was like right here. And there should have been a ladder. There's the food drawer. So we'll be able to go feed when we get back. So I don't know what's up with this. We didn't have the computers that were accessible like we just did right now. What the heck is that? So I don't know if these computers are blocking it or what's the deal. Or it's this or something. All I know is it's not letting us over there because there's a ladder in there that you can access the top of. Let's put this on and see if there's anything. See, I see a ladder right here too. I don't know what that's doing. I thought there was a chest over here as well. Maybe not. Yeah, something's different. This used to go to the right right here. And you went in there and, and, and into this room. And then up on above the room was, or right back into the room was a ladder that you could take to go up to the second floor. And then this looks like it's outside or like dirt or something. So I don't know what that's about. So we maybe have some new things to learn about. I guess we'll find out. It looks at the kind of the same way. That's got to be a window. And there's nothing in these 
cabinets, and that's kind of weird too because the cabinets usually had seed pods in them. And maybe I'm just missing something. Let's get out of here and get our oxygen done. So we're going to have to keep spinning our oxygen bottles. All right. So for now, we'll call that good. I'll have to come back here and search around in that thing and see if I can figure out what's going on. I don't know why we can't access that now. That second floor. Whatever. Whatever's clever. Well, we did get a blueprint or two, I think. How much? What do we got in our inventory? Yeah, we got a, we got stuff back there in the in the box. We can't forget in the chest that we're gonna need to go back to grab. The compass. So we need silicon, magnesium, and another aluminum. Okay, so if you look at the top of our screen now, we have a compass. So that is south, that's west, that's north, and that's east. So that's east that way. That's north towards that planet. That's west out that way, and that's south out that way. So we got the food thing ready to go too, you got to remember. Let's see about building that food deal. Oh, can we build that heater? That makes heater milk. We left all that stuff at the other place, I think. Yep. All right. There's the food deal. We need an aluminum. Why oh, we just grabbed an aluminum? We not only used it when we made the compass. All right, so we're going to have to go get some aluminum. What is that? That's ice. Let's go this way. We'll go out towards that area. Let's drink some water real quick. Let's head out to this area over here towards where the aluminum's at. And we're going to pick some up by hand. Now, there is a gold chest over here. I'm not going to pick it up right now, but I'm just going to show you where it's at. If you don't want to know, go ahead and fast forward. It is right here. You see, it has stuff like iridium rods. It's got the golden effigy. It's got the Nulma seed, which is, I think I'll grab that. This is a 600 oxygen multiplier. I think I'll take that. There's the aluminum that we need. But I'm going to leave these things. I'm not going to empty that chest out right now. And this is the aluminum area. And as you can see, there's one right there. Oh, that's ice. There's another chest in here. Another little chest back over here as well. And there's another wreck over here. Is that ice? And it is. I'm getting low on oxygen, so we're going to have to figure this out real quick. I think the wreck is just, there's some aluminum. I think the wreck is just right there. There it is. There's going to be some cool things in there as well. There's another chest. And a couple more pieces of aluminum. We'll leave the chest, but we'll come back to explore that. I don't want to get ahead of myself here.
And just like any time you get off the beaten path from the main area where your stuff is at, you need to be mindful of the fact that you can get lost really easy or turned around. You're going to have to make some more oxygen. Okay. So I'm going to put the food grower over here with these guys. I'm going to set it right. Oops. Let's go ahead and pick it all back up. All right. So obviously, we're going to need to build another, some more power. Let's just build another windmill. See if that helps. That'll round things out with the windmills right here. Now let's see if we can build that thing. But I was going to say, I didn't see the arrow. You want to make sure you put that forward. So there we go. Let's get it nice and tucked in here. And do we have any seeds on us? No, we don't. But we do have these, which I want to change these out. It's a 200. What was this one? It's 150. Let's take that out. Where's that 600? There it is. Let's put that in there. That's going to be cranking out some oxygen. Let's take this out and let's put the 300 one in. There we go. So now we're cooking with gas. So we need to build two more of these so we can put these other 200 oxygen deals in there because that's where we're going to crank the oxygen up. I think it would produce any that 3.20 now, 13.20 now. So that's the bit of this is rocking. It's rocking right along. All right. So we need to get some food. And I think we're going to grow the other one first. This one, I want to do the bean sprouts. We need to build another one of these growers. Actually, we need to build two more so that we can start planting all of them. Okay, so these will turn into food eventually. It takes a little while. But it will grow in the incubator. Let's see what we need to build another one. We just need some iron. I think we have some in here. Yep. We have another aluminum. Let's grab that. This food is going to become an important commodity soon. Yep, we're going to need more power. Let's see what we need to build the big solar panels with. Magnesium, silicon, aluminum. All right, let's go out and grab the things we need for that. We need some silicone. We want to get more than one because we're going to want to build more than one. Let's find some more silicone over here.
What else is going on? Let's take those. Let's go back and see if we can't build a couple more of those. Well, a couple of those uh, solar panels. Kick the power up a little bit. As you can see, these are quite large. And they put out quite a bit of power. Oh, we just need a couple more. Cobalt. Oh, All right, let's build another one. That should help us with our power situation for a little bit. We need some tea. Two drills going as well. Oh, we're missing iron. I gotta run inside and replenish the oxygen. Is there any more iron in here? Nope. Let's take a drink real fast because it's gonna start crying if we don't. One more fabric. Let's see. There we go. So we should have enough power to last us for a little bit. Now let's see about another food drawer. Did we put food in there? No, we didn't. We might take him. Not what I wanted. I want the pepper. Let's do peppers in the next one. See, it's starting to grow. Where are we at? Let's be vegetarian. 
Okay, so the locker is getting ready to unlock when it hits 50. So we've got nine more. Well, and then after the locker will be the advanced collecting station. We're going to need to start expanding this base. It's getting small. All right. So we need another cloth. So I think what we'll do is we'll run back out to wait before we do that. Let's see what we got in our inventory. Let's drink the water. We got food. We got water. We don't have any oxygen. So we need uh, cobalt. Let's grab some cobalt real fast. Make a couple oxygen bottles. Take with us. So we're going to grab that real quick. Now we're all the way out here. Okay. See, it's kind of, that one kind of got weird. Is that fifty six percent? Okay, so we have oxygen, and we have water, and we have a bunch of silicone. Let's see if we can store some of this stuff. Let's store the silicone. We'll grab that. Store that. Store the aluminum. And let's go see if we can't, uh, oh, do we have any food on us? Yeah. Let's go see if we can't, uh, Get this, uh, oops, we're low on food and water. Let's drink the water. Let's eat the food. Okay. Let's go see if we can't get this ship, uh, over here done. Nice and quick, like. That, the food, the chip, the aluminum. Let's grab the silicon. Let's 
grab an iron. Grab another iron. I think the only problem with stuff out here, I think finding will be the titanium that we're going to need. We need to build us a spot over here too. D3 drill is unlocked. What is this? Titanium, all right. You can build a room now. I think. Where is that ship? Can we pass it? I don't think we do. Oh, there it is, still again. All right, let's go see if we can build a little safe haven over here. Fill our oxygen. All right, let's run over here and see what we can get out of this ship. Wait a second. How did we get in there? Was it up the rock? Can't remember. If it was, I think you got to climb up the rock, drop down through here. And look at all the cases of stuff we have. Let's see, we've got some alloy, aluminum, iridium. Another blueprint. Some more aluminum and iridium. There's another pedestrian seed. There's our other that in there. And we'll get the food and then this. All right, we'll come back to that stuff at a later time. Is there something else here? I don't remember. Yeah, see, now it's showing the drill thing, which we don't have. This is all new stuff. If that gets us out, let's do our oxygen, then we'll head back. We won't be able to build our faster running legs. And eventually we'll get jetpacks for our legs as well. And we'll be able to jump and soar in quite a ways. It's kind of nice when that happens. Because you can really travel the map quickly when you get those hooked up and going. There's the storage locker. Yeah, baby. Now it's time to expand. How much iron do we have on us? This one. We need to get some more iron. We need iron to expand. Iron and titanium. is full. What is going on with that? This chain link thing. What the hell is going on? Why wouldn't it let me put it down? Ah. 
I don't know what that's about. That's new. So it's going to let me chain link to that, but it won't let... Oh, maybe it will let me put it up there. Okay. All right, so we'll go in here. I'm going to build us a ladder. That was probably a bad spot to put that. I'll build this a ladder. Where's my ladder at? That's not it. Wasn't that... Um, I thought that... Um, there it is. We need a cobalt. Maybe that. All right, now we'll be able to travel up and we're upstairs in this one, climb down and go back down. So let's go out back here. This the one on, oh, we need an iron and titanium. Let's unlock these two blueprints and then let's see about getting my legs upgraded. Living compartment corner. D3 mining speed. Let's get that going. Okay, so we have T3 on our mining now. What about our leg upgrades? Okay, so we have everything except for that other fabric that you think is in here. In one of those boxes. There it is. Okay, so what that's done now is increase our movement speed to 30%, so it's twice as fast as we were before. See, the movement change is, is, is noticeable. I mean, it is definitely a thing. But it doesn't, it's not, like, easily noticeable. I guess I don't know how else to put it. Let's get some iron. There's going to be some iron back out this way. We're going to need a silicon. Bunch of silicon out this way. Inventory split. All right, let's go see if we can build some stuff. T3 veggie tube. Yeah, I don't understand why it's not letting us connect to that. It'll let me connect to that, but it's not going to let us put it down here. And I think it has to do with the ground, the dirt. It won't connect because the dirt is higher back here than it was over there. And I think that was the problem. That's the, the rear issue that we're having. Let's see if they'll let us do it here. Yep. All right, so I want to build next to that. So what we'll do is we'll see if we can do it there. And then we can. All right. So now we're going to have a much bigger area in here. 
that widen right up. We're going to have to deconstruct and reconstruct those and move them to somewhere else. And then up here should be bigger as well. Yeah, okay, so we've got room up here. And then we have these rooms over here. So I'm going to do, let me see what my inventory looks like. Yeah, let's deconstruct this. And this, and let's reconstruct those and let's place them oh, somewhere else. I want them close. I think we're going to move the, the heaters back over in the corner over there. So we'll wait to reconstruct those. How much room do we have now? We don't have a lot of room. That's in here. All right, so let's do this. Let's squeeze down through here and let's get around. Let's put up a new locker. That's will afford us to build quite a bit more storage space. Open this up. Let's put all this and this in there. And for now, and let's go to deconstruct and let's deconstruct all this stuff. And we're losing stuff on the ground. Okay. What we want to see is can we grow the, or can we make the big heaters? That's T2. All right, and I'm going to put those back here. I thought we got to unlock the T3 heaters. We're missing titanium. So that's going to be over here on the ground somewhere. Well, I guess it's not on the ground right here. Let's go get us some titanium. Crack to get those heaters back up. I'm going to need more than one. Inventory's full. Yeah. Aluminum and titanium. What have we got in here? I don't have either of those in there. Let's go find some aluminum and titanium. I think we have some in the room over here. We don't have any aluminum over here, but we do have a blue chip. We have some more seeds. And some more iridium. All right, so we'll take that stuff. Let's head back. Let's run out and get some more. That's a meteor shower. Yep. 
Now, in the old game, they couldn't kill you. I don't know if they can kill you now, because they've changed a lot. So they may be... Now, see how I got all red? Now, this should be Iridium that comes down now. I mean, I could be wrong. Let's go over here and see. Nope, it's still just dumping regular ore. Nope. All right. We're missing aluminum. Yeah, I could have swore we had some. Nope. Yes, right there. Oh, we don't have any room. Let's trade. Let's drop it. Grab the aluminum. Make that heater. Okay, so we got... One, two, three of them, and let's see what our heat's doing now. Oh, we can't, because we don't have our things up yet. Let's put them up now. Oh, we're missing a... Okay, so let's look and see what our terraform is doing. Let's turn it this way. So our heat's at 27, so it's cooking along. Let's get this other screen. Progress screen. Oh, I need another cobalt. Thirty-eight point forty percent. So we're almost at forty percent. So that's almost halfway. You still got a long way to go because it slows down a lot. The farther you go, the more it slows down. But we got these cooking pretty good, except for pressure, and that's because we're not running a whole bunch of drills. We're running the T1 drills, and so we need to see what it's going to take to build the T3 drill. It's going to take iron, aluminum, and we can, we can manage all that. So, as you can see, at, at 17 pressure per second, the small heat and doesn't, it does use 8.5. So what I'm going to do now, and we're going to do, go ahead and see if we can make this thing. We need magnesium and silicon. There's silicon, we just need magnesium. What's our food looking like? Okay, so the beans are done, we can grab those. The eggplant's done, the squash is done. So we can grab those for food when we get to that point. Right now we need a what? I want to go see what our power is at, so we need magnesium. All right, let's go make that, sign, that little screen, and then we'll be able to see what our power is at.
So we can open this up and it can show us where our, our, this is our consumption. This is our production. So that's going to need 8.5 for that drill. And that's going to give it, we have plenty of power to run that drill. All right. So let's go out and get the materials. We need, we need aluminum and that. We're going to need more water. So let's get some ice. Ice is going to start becoming scary. Oh, is that aluminum? It sure is. What's all this stuff? It must be stuff we dropped. Or it came down in that storm. Yep, this is all stuff that dropped in that storm because we wouldn't be able to just pick it up like that. What do we need? One more aluminum. I'll leave this stuff for now. So we can run back out this way and we'll find some of these spots where this stuff came down and it'll be looking like it's floating like it's that's it's strange it's not see like right here and maybe we'll come across another aluminum in that or somewhere we're going to need ice we better make some water not our inventory is free let's take this back We at least have one water. Let's do the blueprint real quick. Recycling machine. That's kind of cool. We can't build any of that stuff until we unlock this. And that's going to be... We need 102 more points before we lose that. Let's see. Wait. We need to empty out some of this stuff in our inventory. We just got way too much. Let's see. I don't think we need two of those. We don't need that right now. We definitely don't need to carry it around the plant. And then we'll keep the rest of this stuff because we're trying to make that drill. I don't remember what the drill requires. It doesn't require that, so we can get rid of these. All right. We need aluminum. We gotta go try to find some aluminum. I don't. We could run to either to the cave or to the aluminum area and try to collect it that way. But we'll make it lucky and find some out here. I'm collecting the ice because we need water because we're gonna stop. Let's see if we can find some of these floaty places like these two here, came from the asteroids. Meteors. Plus, there is another place we can get in water. And it's right over here. And there it is. Okay. Let's see if we can get a couple more pieces real quick. There's one. How much speed do we have in the front of the toilet? So we have two. We need one more. And we should be only able One more, and we should be able to build two of those drills. We need one more aluminum. I'm going to be careful and get lost in here real easy, too. All right, let's go. Let's grab the ice. It's present right here. Let's get back out of here. So we get too deep in, and it makes it difficult for us to get out. That thing has dead ends in it and stuff, and you can get turned around real easy. Let's jump up here. Get some oxygen, and then we'll head back to our base, and we'll build those drills.
These are going to be much bigger. I'm going to put them on the other side. Let's see if we can get two of them. Where are we missing? Iron and iron up top. We should be able to find those right here, I think. There's the titanium. There's an iron. Alright, let's go build another one. Then we'll have two rolling. So we have two of them going. What's our pressure look like now? Okay, so now the pressure's picked up and it's starting to move along. And now that we got them all moving in a pretty good sink, they are they are moving this number really quickly, which is nice. Uh, the antenna. Transmission screen. This is going to give us info from off planet. See a piece of iron. Alright, so it's telling me my food level is low. So we're going to eat one of these and I'm going to eat the bean. So I'm going to grab the bean and it automatically, I believe, yep, the new seed goes back into the thing. So now we should have in our inventory a bean. And so we eat it and it raises our food. But it's not like one of these packs. They have way more in the packs. But now it's regrowing it. I can come over here. Oops, I didn't want to open it. I wanted to grab the, the plant and I'm going to eat it. And now our food is full again. And it's starting to wiggle the other one. And we have one here we can harvest as well. I'm going to drink. Now we're going to make a bunch of water because we're almost out. Okay. So now we have plenty of water. All right, we got oxygen. Yep. All right. So I wanted to build this screen here. We have to build the antenna because you can't get messages without the antenna. We're going to need more aluminum for that. But for the screen, we have everything and we need a place to put it. So I'm going to put it. Right on the edge of this, flip it around. And this is where we can get our messages. But to do that, we're going to need this antenna. We need silicon, titanium, and some aluminum. And I think the best place to do that is to go back this way. What did I say we needed? Silicon, titanium. So we'll watch for those ores on our way over here. There's some titanium. 
Keep our eye out for some silicon. I don't think there's a whole lot of silicon over there. And so, right, another rope. Let's see if we can find some for you. And we may have to go back over here. I believe there's another cave up here too on the left down here. I can't remember. It's been, like I say, it's been a while since I played this game. If you guys look up, look through my videos, you'll find how long ago it's been since I made a video of this game. I believe there's a cave right here where these rocks are. I just don't remember what's inside of it. Maybe it's not here anymore. I don't see it now. I know there's another one up there. But I don't think it was this far this way. We have a couple of pieces of silicone, so we have some extra things in here. Nope. Maybe I'm mistaken. There's a chest right here we can check out. My food, Let's see, I leave the water and stuff. I'll leave that water and stuff and then we come back. Now, there is another cave if you follow through this canyon and you hug the right wall, you will come across another cave. It's a pretty big one, and it has. I can't remember what that cave is, it may be the, the this one. The, And the cobalt cave. I just don't remember. Can't remember, man. Something we didn't do that I forgot about. Let's check here. See what we got over here. We did have some silicone in there, so yeah. We didn't need all that. What are we trying to build again? Oh, the antenna. We have the silicone, we have that. We just need the aluminum now. So let's go grab a piece of aluminum real quick. We did this chest, but was there any aluminum in there? Oh, this chest is empty. Look at that thing. There's some aluminum. And a couple of them. All right. Now there's another gold chest over here, and then there's one over in those rocks somewhere. I just don't remember the word right now. Is that aluminum? It is. Let's grab that. I know we're running a little long on this episode, but we're almost done here.
Try to get it up on top of there. Is it not going to let me mount up here? Huh, okay. So it's not even going to let me put it up there anymore. Let me just mount it right there. Oh, we ain't got no power. That can't be good. What do we need for the solar panels? Oh, these are the T1s. These are the T2s. Let's see. We need everything. What do we need for the T1s? What the What the Fuji? And there's those. And there's those. And there's that. And there's these. And there's that. Does that help at all? I think they're short on something. Magnesium and iron. So we don't need that stuff. Let's not put that back. Let's go ahead and... Not that one. Put this one. So we can have that. That and that and that. Let's put these and these in there. Put that in there. Put that in there. Is there something in here that there's not? And that's because it's not reading there. I'm trying to do stuff. And we'll go. That's better. Now we can pass through there without having to do that. All right. So, what was the thing that we needed for the. So we need magnesium, which is abundant in the everywhere. And then right here. And there we go. We're rolling again. Is that going to hit that? No. It's it. All right. Now we can look at our messages and receive messages. We need water. Okay. So I'm going to leave this on the screen for a second. You can pause it if you want to read what it says. Basically explaining that we've entered into a contract with Centennial Corp to do what we claim to do, help transform this planet, terraform this planet. It says they periodically will scan our progress and send us the required blueprints. So there's that. Oh, huh, it's three iron to make those now. It used to be two. We'll dig us up some iron real quick. Didn't want that. Don't want that. This is what I'm after. Is that iron right there? It is. How many do we have? Three. We have five. We need a bunch more. Let's see.
So it's back. And then I think we're going to call this an episode. And we'll pick right back up where we left off tomorrow. But not bad for the end of the second episode. We've come quite a ways. We're getting we're moving right along quite nicely. I'm gonna build us a couple more storage bins. Not gonna let us squeeze it in there. Well, you'll be able to squeeze it in this way. There we go. And so we'll be storage using that for storing stuff. I'm going to fill those up with ore and stuff so we can do some serious building. Anyways, how close are we to getting that on now? 175. We're going to be there before you know it. And we'll probably get that in the next episode. Hopefully you enjoyed the episode. And let's grab that. And if you want to see more, come back for the next episode. We're going to start to spread out, do some more building, and we're going to do some more exploration. I want to go back and try and clean up some of these ships that we've already been inside of. Get all this, gather all the stuff, bring it over, and do some um, exploring to that ship that's up there behind us, above that valley where we spawned at in the beginning. And we'll see if we can't continue to move along and do some more building as we unlock things. Now, one of the things that trips me out is I could have swore in the in that latest uh, test that we were play test we were doing, they had built a bigger living compartment that was like a quad living compartment. It was the size of four of these. She didn't have all these 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 partitions like this, so it was more open and made it easier to build. But I can't. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm thinking of a different game. Anyways, we'll find out. This is crazy with crazy gaming. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like subscribe and hit the bell and uh, don't forget to leave some comments let me know what you think about the series so far and we'll catch you in the next one appreciate you thanks for watching and we'll see you next time bye for now